welcome back. This week we'll be starting a three movie special that will take place over the next three weeks. We'll be taking a look at the Major League series and of course, by design, we'll be starting with the first one. Major League, directed by David Ward, came out in 1989 starring Tom Berenger, Charlie Sheen, and Corbin Burnson. Okay, so let me give you a quick story synopsis. Rachel Phelps inherited the Cleveland Indians and she wants to move them to Florida. How can she get away with this? As if the Indians end up being terrible. How she does this is she invited a bunch of old and out of primes and virtually no ones to spring training in hopes that they will do absolutely nothing. So basically this is a Cinderella story, so I'm sure you can guess what ends up happening. Anyways, how was the acting? Tom Berenger plays an old washed up catcher with bad knees named Jake Taylor. He does a good job in the movie showing his age, but also his experience in the movie. Charlie Sheen plays Wild Thing, Rick Vaughn. Now, I can imagine that he would be a, the favorite of a lot of people that watches this movie, because where he starts the beginning of the movie and where he ends up is way different. He does a great job showing this, and he does a great job in general in acting. Corbin Burnson plays Roger Dorn. He's another washed up player who thinks he's too good to be trying really hard, but near the end, he changes his mind. So, to say the least, the acting is really good. Now, this movie has this subtle charm about it. I can't quite put my finger on it, but when you watch it, you just feel good after the end of the movie. Overall, this movie is really nice with a good story and some good acting. Overall, I give this movie a 8 out of 10. A great movie. Anyways, the next time we'll be taking a look at the second movie in the series, Major League 2. 283 miles an hour, and all the stuff that you see in the movie, that was Charlie doing. Vaughn into the windup in his first offering. 